yeah hello welcome back to the channel so in this video i'll be taking you through how to create a verified paper account in ghana and it's so simple but before that if this is your first time here please hit the subscription button below click the bell icon so that you receive any video that i'll be doing first we do videos on entrepreneurship personal financing investment personal development and budgeting so that you'll be able to what get yourself out there and what start doing something but before we get to the video can you check out this video of mine it talks about um business idea that you can start this 2020 that will be able to start something even if under 100 cities or you don't have any enough capital to start you're able to start something and then what get you out of that stress and if, um before you create paper accounts you need two things you need um valid id card and an email address so if you have all these things if you have all these things let's get to the video now but if you don't have just post it and then create a valid email account and then what come back to the video and then let's continue with it so now that you know of everything about what you need before you start this thing let's get to the video or on the screen and start doing something so now this is um a browser google chrome and when you go to your browser google you enter paypal.com paypal dot com slash le you know ghana is not um um people is not um already uh, it's not in ghana for now so we are using lesotho lesotho's um this to be able to create our account and that is why we are using the le there so you enter the uh, the uh, paypal dot com dot l a slash l e or forward slash l e so that you'll be able to uh, get the so once the this thing has opened all you need to do is to um go to sign up from your desktop or from your browser then after you go to sign do not go to the personal because the personal you cannot use to receive payment but you can just use to what buy things from um others you can just send money but you cannot use it to what um receive payment so you go to the business account and then you click you click on the, you select the business account and then you click on the continue button so you leave your browser to load for a while you leave it to load and once it's opened you just enter your email account so if you have already email account you just need to what you use it but if you don't have some you can just what create a new one and then what use your email account so because the email is very important in creating so i'm going to enter my email account um this is what i'm entering okay so once the email is done i will just click on then you just click on um continue so you leave the browser to so then you create your password so in the password you remember you remember to read the instructions there before you create your password and the password mostly i use my password you, you can you can also use your own because our passwords can never be the same so you use a password that will help you and that you can remember easily so i'm using this password for this account and hey remember this is for just this account so if you want to steal or do something yeah it's your own cup of tea <laughs> so once you are done with the password it will open this page will open then you fill it these are basic information about you so they say business contact so your first legal name so i'm going to use um my name my name is um richard so i'm going to use richard richard okay then i'll use the same name um let's say mensa so business details so legal business details i'm going to use this um um youtube channel name to do it so riches universe okay so once i finish entering then they said the legal number so i'll just enter my number so you select ghana and then you enter the your telephone number so this is Ghana. Then I will just enter my number. So you know there will be a verification code that they will send to your number. So you enter the number. Remember to start with to get off the zero and then start with the first letter that starts the first number that starts because there is no zero attached to it. So you add your number there to be accepted. So they said address line for your business. So this one, you know, its addresses are not that um, valid in Ghana. Although we have the um, the gps and all those stuff but you know they are not valid in ghana as such so you use maybe your town's name or street name or something so i am um, where i am i'm going to use opposite um let's see odoko odoko okay so i'm just using this one maybe one one odoko street let me say like this let's say odoko street okay so address line two this one is optional you can just leave it and then town or city then you see accra 
then province greater accra you, you select that one and then you continue from there then postal code you know um postal code we have the gps now so you can use your gps and the, you can use the first letters um of the gps so here maybe i'll have um um this maybe a greater accra then the first letter one two three or one two five this one will be my gps account then you select the payment or the primary currency for your payment that you'll be doing online so once you are done you click on this checkbox and then what you continue or you agree and continue okay so here you select the type or you describe your business so you select the type of business you are doing so if it's a sole proprietorship business it's a it's a partnership or a corporation so you choose the one that your business fits and once it's an individual something that you are doing for your own transaction and for your online purposes i'm going to use the um individual or sole proprietorship account and then they will say products that you do less so we do uh, services maybe discount stores or sales of something so you just use a system of something so i have this here bicycle shop sales so like this bicycle shop sales this one is um is is it's optional you, you, if you like you'll be able to if you like you provide if you don't like so if, if you have any website address or maybe your facebook or facebook page or something just leave it there leave the link there and then it will give you the right information that you need okay so now that you've done with everything it's time to tell more about yourself so this one too it's just like providing the same information that you provide the other one so you provide your data but you make sure that it's over 18 years so you make sure that the information is over 18 years so 25th let's say January 2000 so 2000 is over 18 years so you'll be able to so nationality then you select Ghana the nationality you select Ghana although you are using Lesotho by they give you the privilege to use Ghana here so here you choose your uh, identity document so national ID or something so use national ID and then you enter the ID card number so here I have my ID card that I want to use so all I have to do is to go to open here and then use my ID card number. I'm not saying you should use the same two. It's just something that um, um, I'm using to um, do this account. So maybe I'm not saying you should use the same thing. Just make sure you have your own ID card, then use it so that you'll be able to uh, prove any information or if there is anything, you'll be able to uh, um You'll be able to provide and was secure your account so here i have um one six two four nine just a number then so i have this account so here it's a home address you can use same as business address and then you don't need to do anything again so then you, call, you click on submit so you just leave your listing to load once it's done hey we are done we are done this is paper for you it's just um it's just like this this is your paypal account you don't need anything all you need is your email account and um your id then after that you go to your account and then what connect all the necessary connect all the necessary um um cards that you have and then but we, you can you can use um this thing unibank uh, you know ub bank africa to be able to what um connect it so that you receive payment and what make payments through it so um the bank you can get it from the uba you just go you say you need this card and then once they give it to you provide it everything then you link your card to it so once you go there you say sometimes they will say you need to create an account before you they'll be able to issue that um um card for you you just create and then what you deposit an amount of 50 cities um to their bank account it's, it's not their bank because the, the account is going to be for you then they will issue that card for you then you'll be able to what make your payment and what do your online payment receive payment from outside the whole world and or, um make your website payment and do, do your sales and everything so this is how we create paper in ghana and it's easy and simple please if you have watched this time please don't forget to what give me the thumbs up and then what share this video to your friends who also need these tutorials um please subscribe to the channel for the next video that i'm doing thank you for watching and have a nice day bye bye